So it was school starting back in early August. My son and I took advantage of the extra daylight to explore the northern regions of Ikefana Creek. Before we headed out, we wanted to check out the local cave. We didn't bring a dive light, so we had to improvise with waterproof and a regular flashlight. out on the spring run that leads to Ikefana Creek. Since Hurricane Michael, the northern end of Ikefana Creek has not been cleared out as much as the lower end of Ikefana Creek where the library is operating. Here we arrive where the spring run meets Ikefana Creek. As you can see, the water is a little browner in the creek than it is in the spring run. There's lots of obstacles. I hit my fin right here. spring run that we arrive at is somewhere around bathtub or glowing spring. As I tried to go down the spring run there was lots of debris still from the hurricane, spider webs, and I had no shoes. Here water trickling. Ikefana Creek is a very unique place in the Florida Panhandle. It's roply 26 miles that travels through karst, limestone, landscapes, sinkholes and caves, and a number of springs that feed into the creek. The name derives from the Creek Native American tribe, which once called it Kana Fena. Kana stood for earthy and Fena meant footlog or bridge. There was once a natural land bridge through the karst geology of the area that uh, Andrew Jackson men once used on their way to New Orleans. The land bridge collapsed sometime in the 19th century. These are some of the challenges we had to face going up the creek. Here's the second spring run we reached. Bit of a beaver dam there. Without shoes, it made this a little bit difficult. Later, I'd go back with some wetsuit booties and change things dramatically. Lots of spider webs across the spring run get wiped away. There are a 
couple springs out of it. I'll be back. I thought a water pump out of there, but I'm not sure if it's just going under the tree from the spring run. After a few more obstacles, we decided to go ahead and call it a day and head on back. Yeah, it's a lot faster going down the street. One more stop before we head home. Check out this little cave that uh, my son had. Please like and definitely subscribe to check out more aquatic adventures. We have many more coming.